subscribe play pals thank you so much for clicking on this video and if you're new to our channel click that red subscribe button ring that notification bell so you get updates anytime we upload new videos before we get into the video first i want to thank all of my awesome subscribers thank you guys for clicking and sticking with me and i want to give a super shout out to some of you guys thank you so much for watching commenting liking the video and sharing it with others so guys, today we're going to be unboxing the new Series 1 LOL Surprise JK Guys. These are mini fashion dolls. The Series 1 dolls, actually, let me tell you, on the back, they have four of them. We've got Diva, MC Swag, Queen Bee, and Neon Cutie. So Neon Cutie was one of the ones that I wanted, as well as Diva. So I think the flared uh, look of Divas and Neons uh, will probably look a little better on their little bodies. So even though um, they're gonna be a little taller, they're gonna have like platform boots or shoes or whatever, which is gonna be kind of cool. Um, but I wanna see what they look like. I may collect them all, but so far I've only ordered Diva and Neon and Neon came. So I wanted to unbox her today for you guys to do that. But before we start unboxing her, I also wanted to show you guys a couple things. Oh, I do have the original like Neon. Um, this one actually came in my playset. I unboxed it um, off camera because I wanted to have her, because I wanted to compare what she looks like with the other one because this one has real hair and stuff like that and I thought it would be kind of cool to see. So I wanted to be able to show that to you guys. And then also I actually have Neonlicious and I styled Neonlicious for you guys. I made this beret guys. I, I sewed it by hand. It was really easy to do. I think I'm going to do a tutorial on how to do this because I think I'm going to be making a bunch of these for my dolls. I love the one that came with the original Neonlicious but the like animal print or whatever it doesn't go with everything so I want to be able to make more of these and it was so super easy so I will do a tutorial on that. So this is Neonlicious in her outfit of the day guys. She has on a bunch of stuff from my other OMG dolls but she also has this little Barbie purse and she has on a little balloon dress that I made and then over the top of the dress I put on a haunt couture skirt um, so I thought that that was cute and so guys this is the look that I have for Neonlicious. Now the other thing I did want to mention before we get into the video is recently I did a video and it was a head-to-head -head battle, it was Battle of the BBs, where we had Chillax versus Class Prez. And you guys have been commenting, letting me know who you thought won the battle, and I still haven't declared a winner, but I will do that, I promise. But in the meantime, in the comments below, I want you guys to let me know if there's an OMG doll that you guys would like to see battle another OMG let me know who you would like to see battle one another for example would you like to see busy BB versus dazzle or would you like to see Candylicious versus Roller Chick. I mean, what would you guys like to see? Let me know who you want to battle and I'll see what I can do to make it happen. Um, OMG to OMG. Now, before we get into unboxing this girl, I want to mention something. Um, I'm an adult doll collector and I love dolls, like small dolls, big dolls and everything. And some of you guys may not want, you know, these little dolls. You may be, maybe you just collect like the Barbies or the OMG dolls or larger dolls. This may not be something that you're interested in. Um, I really like to collect some of the smaller LOLs as well as, you know, a doll like this because it gives you great options if you want to style your dolls, if you take photos with them on Instagram and stuff like that. And also, it actually looks pretty good uh, for your collection. So I would just, you know, hey, don't sleep on the little doll. So let me go ahead and unbox this one and we'll see what it's all about. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to take this out. Um, and I'm sure there's some little goodies in here. Oh, now this is so cool, guys. So, so cool. I think this is awesome. I love this little playset. Oh my gosh. It is so cool. I love that. It's got the Miss Positive purse. You guys know I love that purse. That is like the thing. And then look at this. It's got a little bag and stuff, little garment bags and stuff, almost like big sis. So if you unbox Neonlicious, you'll see um, she has bags and stuff like this. So this is really awesome. So I'm going to take all of these out. 
So this is an awesome little play set. I think this is going to be cool for styling my dolls and posing them and stuff like that. These little um, mini fashion dolls. These little mini fashionistas. And um, so anyway, some things came inside. I took them out. And oh, she's got her own little shoe box. And look, she wears a size three and a half, which is so cute. I'm going to go ahead and open this little shoe box because I really want to see what these shoes look like. These little platform shoes oh now these are so cute oh she has like little like it's like glitter or whatever little flakes and stuff inside her shoes this is so cute so look at that adorable okay I love those so her shoes are very similar to her big sister's shoes uh, the original outfit that she comes with and this is so awesome I like it I like it oh, a little paint rubbed off but still so cute I'll have to put a dab of paint on there to cover up that little white spot but I love these so she came with a few little bags so let's open this one first and it's the same like color of like her big sister's garment bag so this is so cute let's see what she's got so this is a little top and it is cute so this is gonna be nice to put on our girl real outfit and in this garment bag let's see what we've got oh she's got her own little hanger how cute so I'm gonna have to create a little closet for, for this stuff and this is her little skirt it is so cute love it so there's no velcro or anything it just kind of goes around her waist so this is going to be nice to put on your girl and we've got something in here so let's see what it is so she's got a little juice box cute and she's got some stuff in here let's see what's in here usually accessories come in a little round box oh she's got a lot of stuff guys so she's got some glasses she's got like some little kitty ears cute a little backpack with wings on it and she's got this little bracelet which is gonna be cute okay so that's all the little blind bags and stuff that came inside so now we're going to open this little compartment up and check out our girl so this comes inside, it has information about the doll, and let's see what it tells us. Sometimes I get so excited I don't even look at it, and I miss some major things. So let's see what it says. Oh, it tells us how to put together their little doll stand. It says only certain dolls change color, so I don't know if ours will change color. So that's good information to know. The other thing I was doing when I was unboxing is I did want to show you guys that this has like a little zipper and you can kind of move it up and down and it kind of shows you what the doll looks like like this would be a regular one and then she's taller so that kind of is pretty cool I love that it's nice you need to make a little gif of that so cool and then of course we looked at the little playset on the back let's go ahead so I took her out and guys this is your girl look at how cute she is she has real hair so that is awesome we need to take her out of these plastic and everything she comes with a brush and a stand just like the big omg dolls so here's a closer look yes she's got like real hair and she's got like the little uh pink highlights and stuff so her hair feels really good and it's super cute and she has on a little like um like a little leotard outfit <laughs> underneath this little leotard which is cute 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 and I think it looks great. Love it. I don't want to put her in the water. I don't even want to test her to see if she's a color changer. Is that wrong of me? I don't. I don't want to. I'll have to figure that out later. So Neon Cutie is all dressed, guys, and she is a cutie, okay? I love this outfit on her. The only thing I would change, if I could change anything, is the cat ears. I don't know if I really love the black. I'm sure they probably did it so it would like stand out or something, but... I think I would like it just a little more if they were like a bright pink or maybe even a, a little lime kind of uh, neon green yellow whatever you want to call this color I think that would be cute but other than that I mean it's still fabulous and I love her love her love her love her and I'm so happy that I got her and we've got her little stand and I'm gonna put that together and it goes together just like 
an OMG doll, which is so adorable. Look at this little stand, guys. Awesome. So she can be on her stand and she can be with big sis. This is so cute. Now the other thing that I wanted to compare is I wanted to look at her face compared to the face of the original one and see if they look similar. They almost look the same except um, the eye makeup is different. So the JK doll actually has some shadow uh, that you can see and she has the little squiggly um, eyebrows which is a little different. But other than that, they're pretty close in terms of how they look. Almost twinsies, not quite, but almost. So again guys, that's Neon Cutie and of course she's got her little juice box and she has her little backpack that I didn't put on. But you guys let me know what you think about the JK doll, Neon Cutie, and if you think you might get some of them. Um, I am looking forward to having her and posing her with Big Sis. We're gonna be posing for some photos on the gram. So you guys follow me on Instagram if you're not following me on Instagram. If you're new here, please click that red subscribe button, ring that notification bell, and join the Instant Ride Play family. Again, I'm an adult doll collector. I love playing with dolls and I work to support my doll habit. And so if you guys want to support me, click that subscribe button and I look forward to seeing you guys here more. So leave me some comments below. But that's all we had today on Instant Ride Play. But before we go, I just wanted to say, even if you have a hard day, we hope you find some time to play and we'll see you next time on Instant Ride Play. Every time I trip, it's a free fall. Why don't you help me the way I help you? you